Welcome back. We may not be able to go out like we're used to doing on Mother's Day, but Claire Koenig from Visit Milwaukee is joining us now with some tips on how you can keep active this weekend. Okay, Claire, so let's start with uh, music, right? A lot of moms like music. Tons of music um, and no studios is doing some of the best like arts and cultural program I've seen. It's like they have something almost every day. Tomorrow night is a Will Rose concert. It'll be streamed on No Studios Facebook page, so be sure to head there. He's kind of like funk, hip hop, and pop all in one. Uh, so definitely check that out. Okay, so I know another popular uh, pastime with the moms, especially on a weekend, is wine. And I understand that we got some wine with maybe some art attached. I think you're right, uh, <laughs> speaking as a mom. Uh, so Splash Studios is doing a virtual paint session. These have been super popular and it's easy to see why. So you go to Splash, you pick up your kit. It includes everything you need for paint. It also includes the wine and the clock shadow cheese curds. So you're supporting another local business by doing that as well. And then you tune in to Splash's um, website tomorrow night and they walk you through how to create your painting. And then, of course, you know, big tradition on Mother's Day is going out for brunch. I know maybe we can't do that this year, but um, any any places that are doing special menus or even maybe special programming along with a Mother's Day meal that you can do, you know, curbside pickup or delivery? Um, I would say almost all of them. So my plea to the community is don't cook on Mother's Day. Certainly your mother should not be doing any cooking. Um, instead, support a local restaurant. I know Miss Molly's is doing a breakfast in bed for mom. I know Saz's just rolled out their curbside pickup and they also have the take and heat meals if you don't wanna eat it right away. Um, there are tons of options. Pick your favorite restaurant and order from them this weekend um, because it's more important than ever to support these businesses and this is the perfect occasion to not cook. Do you wanna give a... Uh not so discreet guidance to your husband on where you want to get uh, carry out from on Sunday. This is your first Mother's Day, right? Yes, this is my first, and I hope he is listening to this, in fact. <laughs> All right, so where should he order from? Oh, well, actually, Saza, that their menu is awesome. The meatloaf for two sounds perfect. Baby can't have meatloaf yet, so... All right, Claire, thanks so, thanks so much for joining us. Happy Mother's Day to you and, of course, to all the other moms out there. You can find more information on all the events we discussed on our website, tmj4.com, if you want to just head to the links section.